Hello folks and welcome to my latest uh, PBR narrated Wi-Fi battle. Um, I try to choose different coliseums when uh, going for random Wi-Fi matches um, just to mix it up and I realized I hadn't chosen Courtyard in a while um, and here's the reason why. The fog is deep. Every time you see that you can say it with me. Um, so anyway, there's going to be some accuracy drops and some hacks, and it's not going to be fun. Um, but anyway, I'm playing a zero-level uh, game right now, not knowing uh, his uh, skill, so I go ahead and use Ice Beam, even though I was pretty sure he was going to switch out. The fog is deep. Anyway, uh, I know that there's a fire-type move coming, so i got to pull back Glaceon, uh, and I choose to send out my Uxie. Um, who is pretty bulky with its defenses, so it should be able to take whatever Infernape dishes out. And here comes an Overheat, um, which does more than half, but it can survive another hit, um, thanks to the special attack drop. So I'm going to go ahead and use Psychic on the next turn. The Fog is deep. Uh, anyway, uh, my opponent's predicting that, and so pulls back Infernape, uh, and is going to switch uh, back into uh, Torterra, who is a special defense um, beast, and so the Psychic is going to do nothing. Um, and so I'm going to be forced to switch out on the next turn. The fog is deep. Anyway, Uxie is going to go ahead and use U-Turn here, which is going to hit a little bit harder than Psychic did. Uh, yeah, it gets Torterra down to about half HP, so I'm figuring this is all good. Um, Uxie falls back, and I'm going to go ahead and send... Um, I'm going to go ahead and send Glaceon back out. Um, she was ex my opponent was expecting that and used Stone Edge, but it missed, thanks to the fact that the fog is deep. Anyway, um, Torterra is pulled back, um, and we're just having another rehash, and out comes Infernape. This is great for me because I'm just racking up the damage. Glaceon's special attack is so high that um, even with resisted attacks, just see how much that does. Um, and anyway, the fog is deep. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and pull back Glaceon because even with the accuracy drops, uh, I'm not going to want to, you know, get hit by an overheat. So I go ahead and send out Blastoise, who I figure can survive the hit since it's uh, resisted anyway. Here comes the overheat, and um, as you can see, it does a little bit less than half, and Infernape's got a special attack drop. Not only that, it's got life orb damage, so I, um, I survive, meanwhile Infernape dies. So all in all, pretty good for me. Um, the fog is deep. Uh, there's some leftover recovery action, which is nice, uh, and out comes uh, Torterra again. I still don't know what his final Pokemon is. Uh, I go ahead and use Ice Beam, uh, and I thought it missed, but no, it was just a Yachi Berry, so uh, that's great. Um, so far I haven't had any uh, fog-related hacks, um, even though he's had one or two. Um, anyway, here comes a Wood Hammer, which is going to take us both out thanks to the recoil. So um, I'm going to be up two Pokemon to his one remaining Pokemon, who I don't know who it is yet. Um, so we're both down. Uh, down goes Blastoise, and uh, down goes Torterra. Uh, and so I'm going to go ahead and send Glaceon back out, not knowing the fog is deep. Not knowing uh, what he's got uh, as his last Pokemon. Uh, and it turns out it's Swampert. So I'm like, jeez, oh, uh, well what can I do here? Uh, I'm going to go ahead and use Ice Beam, uh, just the most powerful attack I've got, and as you can see, it's going to be a two-hit KO, so I'm like, yes, I think I can take it out, as long as it doesn't super effectively kill me. Instead, I was not predicting this, it's a Mirror Coat, uh, which is going to devastate me, and um, now we're each down to our last Pokemon, and my last Pokemon uh, is Uxie, who is, in, is at less than half HP. Um, the fog is deep. But that's okay, because Uxie, when I'm not running Stealth Rock, runs uh, Grass Knot. But no, I forgot to switch it out, so I've got Stealth Rock in here, which is completely useless. So I'm going to go ahead and use Psychic, um, which I get the Fog Hacks now, uh, and Swampert used, gets Hydro Pump, and I was like, oh no, this is it. But Uxie survives, which is great. Um, the Fog is deep. And so uh, I'm going to go ahead and keep using Psychic, since it's the best I can do. Um, and it's gonna, it looks like it might two hit KO Swampert, so as long as, uh, I don't know. Anyway, he gets the, um, fog hacks now. The fog is deep. And so it all depends on who can actually hit whom. So I go ahead and use Psychic again, um, but it misses. I'm hoping his attack misses, but it doesn't. Ice Beam hits, and the match is over. Thanks to the fog. That really wasn't actually as much hacks as I was expecting. Um, I looked it up, Fog only decreases your accuracy by one level, the equivalent of everyone using um, 
uh, double team uh, once. But anyway, that was the match. Hope you enjoyed it. Comment, rate, subscribe, and never forget that the fog is deep. <laughs>